It's the magic of math here, and today we're going to be finding the area of a trapezoid. We're going to do this by identifying the two triangles and finding their area, and then the rectangle that joins them and find that area and add the areas together. We have a four-part question today where we're given figure JKLM composed of triangle JKN and trapezoid KLMN. We're told that the base of the figure of JKLM, the entire trapezoid, is 15 inches, and that line segment JN is 3 inches in length. Here's part A of our four-part question. What is the length in inches of line segment NM? If you think you can do this, go ahead and pause and then come back. If not, continue to hang out with me. So we're going to identify the length in inches of line segment NM, which is right here, NM, and we want to know its length. In the original figure, we're told that the base of JKLM is 15 inches. So the entire figure, JKLM, is this entire image figure. So from J to M is 15 inches. It really helps to label this when you have it. Looking at line segment JN, they're telling us that that's 3 inches. So JN is right here, the base of this triangle. JN is 3. So we know this entire length is 15. So 3 plus this unknown amount needs to equal 15. So let's write that down. 3 add the unknown amount equals 15. So what value added to 3 will equal 15? Well, we know that that is 12 inches. So we can conclude that line segment NM is 12 inches. Here's part B. Part B asks us, what is the area in square inches of triangle JKN? And show or explain how you got your answer. So if you think you got this, go ahead and pause. Come back when you're done. So we're going to find the area in square inches of triangle JKN. The formula for area of a triangle is area equals one half multiplied by its base multiplied by its height. So we're going to identify the base, which we just found right here. It was given in the problem is three. And the height of the triangle is always perpendicular to its base, which they've labeled here as four. So let's put those values in. Our base right here is 3, and our height is 4. Let's multiply 3 by 4. That product is 12. Half of 12 is 6. So we know that the area of triangle JKN is 6 square inches. Here's part C. What is the area in square inches of trapezoid KLMN? Show or explain how you got your answer. Let's go ahead and pause. Come back when you're done. We're looking for the area of trapezoid KLMN. So let's first identify that. That's this rectangle and this triangle. We just got in part B that the area of triangle JKN is six square inches. So that's not part of what we're finding here, but we know that this triangle over here has the same area because it has the same height of four and the same base as three. So we know that this is also square inches, six square inches. So we wanna find the area of the rectangle and add it to one triangle to get trapezoid K, L, M, N. So let's bring that over here. We have rectangle and our triangle. We know our triangle has an area of six. So the formula for area of a rectangle is base multiplied by height. We have our base here is nine. So let's label that. And our height over here is four. So four times nine is gonna be our nine of our base multiplied by a height of four. Nine times four is 36. Four times nine is 36. Order doesn't matter when you're finding the product. So the area of the rectangle is 36. We're gonna add the area of the rectangle and we get 42. So this trapezoid is 42 square inches. Remembering, it's just KLMN, so this triangle was not included in that. However, when we move to part D, 
We want to know what is the total area in square inches of figure JKLM. Show or explain how you got your answer. I think you have this part. Go ahead and pause, find the total area, and then come back and hit play to see the solution. Welcome back. So the total area in square inches of this entire figure, JKLM, is the whole trapezoid that's pictured here. So we're going to take the area of each part of this, the triangle, add the rectangle, add the triangle. So we know that the area of the triangle is 6, add the area of our rectangle, which is 36, add the last triangle, which is 6, and when we add those all together, 6 plus 36 plus 6 has a sum of 48, so the entire trapezoid is 48 square inches in area. And that is how you find the area of a trapezoid by breaking it down into two triangles and a rectangle. That's the magic of math, where we master math one video at a time. Thanks for joining me today, and I hope you'll come back soon.